Frederick Law Olmsted is best remembered today as the landscape architect who designed New York City's Central Park, but he first achieved fame in the 1850s as a travel writer. He began his career in 1852 with an account of his tours of public parks of Europe. Later that same year, he began his travels to the U.S. South, writing dispatches to the New York Times. He later published three volumes about his trips, including A Journey in the Back Country. In this book, Olmsted wrote about the land, the people, agriculture, industry, and slavery. He was not usually complimentary about what he found. He often commented on poor transportation and accommodations. He was especially critical of slavery and argued that slavery held the South back from economic and social progress. Unlike many Northern abolitionists, though, Olmsted had little interest in individual African Americans, and his portrayals of them were typically quite racist. Nevertheless, his books influenced many Northerners politically convincing them that slavery must not be allowed to expand into the West.